Thank you, Mr. Speaker. If Congress fails to act, the sequester is going to trigger mindless, across-the-board cuts that will hurt middle-class New Hampshire families and undermine our economy. There's no question that we do need to reduce the deficit, but we have to do it in a balanced way that distinguishes between wasteful spending that we cannot afford to keep and critical investments we cannot afford to cut. We cannot afford to cut investments in research in colleges like Dartmouth and UNH. We cannot afford to cut investment in programs that prepare our students for the 21st century economy, like those at Nashua Community College. We cannot afford to cut investments in critical defense systems produced by companies like BAE that protect our troops and create good jobs. The only way to protect these priorities while avoiding the sequester is for both parties to pass a balanced bipartisan plan that will responsibly reduce the deficit, grow our economy, and protect middle class families. Now is the time for Congress to step up and do its job. Thank you, and I yield back the balance.